Okay, so get this right. Reality TV fans, you know we love to dish about all things messy and dramatic. I mean, who doesn't, right? Yeah, especially when it involves a certain recently divorced pair from a little show we all know. Okay, okay, I see where you're going with this. Wait. We're talking about Brittany Cartwright and Jax Taylor, right? Yeah, ding, ding, ding. We've got a winner. <laughs> And let me tell you, their appearance at Us Weekly's Reality Stars of the Year event. Oh, this is going to be good. Spill the tea. Yeah. This event is basically a breeding ground for juicy celebrity confessions, isn't it? Oh, absolutely. Think about it. You've got all these reality stars dressed to the nines under one roof. Cameras flashing, microphones in their faces, and that unspoken pressure to say something, well, interesting. Exactly. It's like the perfect recipe for some unscripted drama. And this year... Well, Brittany and Jax were the main ingredients, wouldn't you say? Front and center, especially after that very public, very messy split. Okay, so give us a rundown what went down. So picture this. Brittany Cartwright, sashaying down the red carpet, looking like a million bucks. Okay, I can already tell she's not crying over spill. <laughs> so whatever, Jax spilled. Oh. Milk, was it metaphorical milk? Let's go with metaphorical milk for now. <laughs> but you're right. She was all smiles, talking about enjoying the single life. She even hinted that we'd seen this whole new chapter of hers play out on the next season of Vanderpump Rules. Oh, interesting. So she's leaning into this new phase then, not shying away from the spotlight. Not even a little bit. Everything about her at the event just screamed confidence, like she's really owning her story. And that's smart, you know, taking yeah. control of the narrative. 100%. And then there's Jax. Uh-oh. Here comes the drama, I bet. He yeah. was there too. And let's just say he did not hold back. He basically admitted that this past year has been the absolute hardest of his life. Wow. Okay, that's heavy. To make things even more intense, he compared it to, get this, his father's death. Whoa. That is raw. You have to wonder what's going through his head, putting it all out there like that. Yeah, it really makes you think. And while it sounds like they're both going through it, they both seem committed to co-parenting their son, Cruz. Which, let's be honest, is no walk in the park. Yeah. Especially with a three-year-old and the added pressure of, you know, the entire world watching your every move. You're telling me there's no instruction manual for being a reality TV single parent. Right. And that's got to be tough navigating all that. But at least they're both on the same page when it comes to putting crews first. Absolutely. It seems like they're trying their best to make things as normal as possible for him. Now, are you ready for the real kicker? Hit me with it. Even though they were both at the event under the same roof. Don't tell me. They totally avoided each other, like ships passing in the night. What do you make of that? Well, there are a couple of ways to look at it. Maybe it's a strategic move, like they're trying to keep things drama-free, especially for crews. Avoiding that awkward run-in. Exactly. Or, and this is just me speculating here. Please do. That's what we're here for. Maybe there's still some unresolved stuff between them, you know, some right. lingering tension that they haven't quite worked through. Makes you wonder if all the cameras and the pressure of the show just makes it that much harder to move on, yeah, doesn't it? totally. So what does this all mean for them? What does the future hold for Brittany and Jax, both as individuals and in the Vanderpump first? Only time will tell. Maybe they'll find a way to peacefully coexist. Maybe things will explode again. Right. Will their paths cross again in some unexpected way? Will we see them hashing it out on the next season of Vanderpump Rules? I mean, a girl can dream. It's reality TV gold either way, and you know we'll be <laughs> here to break it all down. Wouldn't miss it for the world.